One study looking at the determinants of sexual attraction reported that women were more likely to rate muscular men as most attractive. The same is true in this study where the researchers found that a physique that exhibits upper body strength is a strong predictor of visual attraction. In another study, both women and men indicated that muscles in the upper body were important to men's attractiveness. That's why in this video, I want to share 5 upper body exercises that make you look bigger and more attractive. Focus on these key exercises and you'll not only look bigger and more jacked faster, but you'll instantly increase your level of attractiveness. Exercise number one, low incline bench press. According to this eye movement analysis study, women consistently direct their visual attention to the upper part of a man's body, particularly the chest. And research suggests that the bench press one rep max is tightly correlated to pec size and strength, meaning the bigger your bench, the bigger your pecs at least to a degree. But one study sought to answer the question of which bench press variation will give you the best bang for your buck. They placed electrodes over the lower, middle, and upper chest alongside the triceps and front delts. They found that at a 30 degree angle, activation of the anterior delts and upper fibers of the pecs was maximum. For the lower and middle fibers, traditional flat bench was best and there was little to no difference in tricep stimulation across all angles. Looking at the graph, however, you can see that 15 degrees is not only great for hitting all fibers of the pec, it also elicits more activation of the deltoids. And while most people will notice that they can do substantially more weight on a flat bench than a traditional incline of about 45 degrees, this low incline variation gives you the best of both worlds. Not only is it easier to load than the traditional incline variation, but it also produces more activation in both the upper chest and delts. Exercise number two, pen lay row. In this study, men with a wider upper torso are perceived as more physically dominant, fit, and better protectors. Thus, men with well-developed backs are deemed to be more attractive. And if you want to add the most most mass to your back as possible in the least amount of time, I recommend the pen lay row. Not only is it a compound movement that targets all of the upper body pulling muscles, but it's probably the best exercise for applying load through your entire back musculature. On top of that, since every rep is initiated from a dead stop, the momentum is removed from the equation reducing the risk of injury. The exercise acts as a hybrid between a barbell row and a chest support row. As the arms are in a higher degree of shoulder flexion when performing a pen lay row versus a traditional barbell row, it can be safe to say that there is a greater stimulus on the lats as their main function is shoulder extension. This exercise also hits the traps, rhomboids, and rear delts as well as the spinal erectors, making it a complete back builder. Exercise number three, cable lateral raises. The V taper marked by broad shoulders and a narrow midsection has been linked to heightened levels of attraction. And since the first two exercises already cover the front and rear delts, our focus here is on the mid delts. To achieve round 3D delts, the movement of choice would be a lateral raise. The issue with a traditional dumbbell lateral raise, however, is that it provides little to no tension at the bottom of the rep and a lot of tension from roughly 30 to 90 degrees of abduction. This rough resistance profile means that the muscle is getting targeted mostly in its shortened range and not in its lengthened range, which is why I recommend including a cable variation instead. This study reveals that cable lateral raises provide continuous tension throughout the entire range of motion, emphasizing both the lengthened and shortened positions compared to dumbbells. In this study, comparing internally, neutral, and externally rotated hand positions found that a neutral grip showed the highest activation of the mid delts. The same study also noted that a more extended arm equals higher rates of activation due to the increase in the external moment arm. Lastly, execute the lateral raise in the scapula 
perpendicular plane, raising your upper arm about 45 degrees from your clavicle. This not only positions the delts optimally for shoulder abduction, but also minimizes injury risks. Exercise number four, grip training. Unlike most muscle groups usually hidden beneath layers of clothing, your forearms are almost always on full display. It's that subtle yet impactful touch that sets you apart in any social setting. Research published in the Journal of Physical Therapy Science suggests that grip strength is strongly correlated with the muscle size of your forearms. In other words, if you want bigger forearms, make sure you train your grip. For this, we have a few options. First is the plate pinch. This consists of taking two plates and pinching them together between your thumb and your other fingers. The goal with this exercise is to squeeze the plates hard enough to prevent them from slipping past each other and falling to the floor. I recommend starting light with two five pound plates and gradually working your way up from there. A second option is the straight arm hang or cliffhanger. This exercise is performed by hanging from a pull up bar with arm arms fully extended. Once you're able to hang for 45 to 60 seconds, you can increase the difficulty by adding a weight belt or by holding a dumbbell between your feet. And our third option is the barbell hold. For this one, grab the bar with an overhand grip, hands shoulder width apart, and lift it off of the rack while keeping your arms fully extended. Then you'll simply hold the bar until your grip gives out. Progression with this variation can be accomplished by simply increasing hold time, adding more weight to the bar, or both. Exercise number five, snatch grip barbell shrug. No muscle group screams jacked like mountainous traps that sit high on the sides of your neck. And because the main function of the upper traps is shoulder elevation, it's no surprise that I'm including shrugs. That said, research has proven that having your arms in a degree of abduction rather than directly at your sides leads to a greater degree of upper trap activation. That's why I recommend a snatch grip barbell shrug where you're leaning slightly forward. And although the exercise is quite simple, Simple to perform, there are a few mistakes you should avoid when performing a barbell shrug. For starters, gripping the bar at shoulder width as you would on a traditional shrug while standing completely upright is going to limit the amount of upper trap activation. Another classic mistake is failing to control the weight on the eccentric portion of the lift. For best results, make sure you're gripping the bar at a width where it sits right at the top of the pubic bone when standing upright. Lean your your torso slightly forward and shrug the bar up and inward as if you're trying to touch your shoulders to your ears. Control the weight on the way down and initiate the rep once your arms are completely straight and the traps are fully lengthened. So there you have it. 5 upper body exercises that make you more attractive. Make those 5 movements a staple in your training and you'll have no problem building a physique that commands attention. Did you find this video helpful? If so, click the like button below as it'll truly help out the channel. Also, if you're an intermediate or advanced lifter whose muscle gains have stalled and are looking to jumpstart new muscle growth, grab a copy of Mass 5 Full Body. This is a high frequency full body workout workout for intermediate and advanced lifters who are looking to take their physique to the next level. And right now, you can get an additional 25% off by using the coupon code MASS25. If you want to learn more, click the link in the description below. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe for more videos and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next one. Peace.